Good morning students, before entering into RBC and WBC pipette, nowadays commonly many colleges use micro pipette. So that is the latest one but still. And questions can come from RBC and WBC pipette also. That is this one, old method. Today I am going to explain about the difference between RBC pipette and WBC pipette. It is easy but still some mistakes can happen. For example, if you see here I am showing RBC pipette, WBC pipette. I immediately will say this is RBC pipette because there is a red color mouthpiece, white WBC paper, white color mouthpiece, but the problem is sometimes when they wash, after you, every time you finish the particles when they are cleaning, this can be removed, see here, yeah. So I may even misplace this white, so it is correct. Based upon the mouthpiece you can tell, but if the mouthpiece is correctly inserted. So what I want you to tell is, please note down, this is very important. If you see here RBC pipette, yeah, this is called a bulb. So inside the bulb you are having a red color bead which is moving. So RBC pipette contains red bead and you can see here. So WBC pipette contains white bead. So don't tell mouthpiece alone as the reason for identification. So main thing, the bulb of RBC pipette, yeah, maybe I can tell parts also, just to concentrate. Okay, this is stem portion, this is bulb. So inside the bulb, red bead is RBC pipette. Inside the bulb, white bead in WBC, that's why the name. The bead color is for that respective thing. So red color for RBC pipette, white color for WBC pipette. See the markings, uh, with the markings also you can tell whether it is RBC or WBC, but just concentrate 0 0.5, 1, 101. So if 101 comes means that is RBC pipette, question they will ask in exam, 0 0.5 what, millimeter or centimeter or micrometer, don't tell any unit because it is just parts like that. So based upon the ratio, it is 0 0.5 parts, 1 parts, 101 parts, please, please don't tell the unit like 1 micrometer. 101 micrometer, nothing, no units. Same thing, WBC just concentrate here, 0 0.5, 1, 11. If you ask 0 0.5, what means? It is 0 0.5 parts, parts. So it is this and this are equal. This is 11 means this is 10 parts. So WBC is 0 0.5, 1, 11. If you watch the pipette, you can clearly understand the bore. That is called bore through which the blood enters. The bore, yeah, you can see the hole. This is wider in W, you remember WW. So it is wider in WBC pipette, the bore through which the blood is going to come and this is RBC pipette, the bore is narrow or the bore through which the blood is going to come in RBC pipette is narrow. So WW, that mnemonic you can remember, very easy. So white bore for W. so these are the differences between RBC and WBC pipette. In upcoming video, I will tell you about why the dilution factor, how to calculate. Thank you.